hello everyone my name is isaac matt and i will be showing you how to use the render forest.com to make um, a 3d explainer video okay so just search for render just search for render forest and pick the first one renderforest.com okay so we are going to be using renderforest.com so what you need to do is to if you have not created your account just go ahead and open an account with render forest is very free click on get started and then what do you want to create you can use the render forest to create videos you can use it to create logos mock-up websites and um, graphical representations but we are going to be using this render for us to create a 3d explanation video so i'll just click on video okay and then select this scene here there are a lot of scenes there are a lot of um there are a lot of options like the whiteboard animation we have the logo intro so there are a lot of things you can actually do with the render forest but i'm just going to focus on the 3d explanation video in this record so just click on it and then click on create now so i'm going to click on add a scene okay if you have done maybe a previous work you can just click on load a preset okay and then you can also type your script for the render for us to make a suggestion for you so i'll just click on add a scene so um just like the protagon okay each you have to choose a scene for each action to be done okay so let's say i want to make a video like um how do you want to make more money athlete marketing is here for you something like that okay so first of all i'll use the happy man that is waving at me just click on it and click on insert so without wasting much of our time i'm just going to explain this menu above the first one is to make editing in your work the second one is um just like the tabs how you want um how you want like the look now you can see the 3d look you can make it look 2d and you can make it look 3d you have the transition okay how you want it to switch from one slide to another okay you can choose any one you want how you want it to switch from one slide to another and we have the font but most of them are pro that's you have to pay some amount of money to access them okay so the third icon is to change your color the color of your background okay so you can like, you can choose something like this like this and the rest okay so let's say i'll go with this the fourth icon here is to add a music or maybe a voice note or whatsoever okay this icon here is to save your work and this is the menu so this th these three dots here i just click on is to um change the duration of your scene okay change the duration of your scene you can give it six seconds 10 seconds depending on how long you want it to stay so quickly i'll go back to my pencil icon and just start editing so um i think that's all i'll add just click on snapshots to save it completely if you want then click on the plus sign then choose another scene hi i want to make more money athlete marketing marketing is here for you okay so the scene you are going to be selecting should be able to pass out the information the text is passing out just like you say hi want to make more money then you should choose 
someone holding money. Okay, let me see. I'm using this now. So just click on save and close. Okay, and when you are done editing, click on snapshot to save the work completely. Okay. So I'll click on plus sign and add another scene. Let's say I'll use a man holding a, a money. Okay. You can also use the search button to search for which scene or similar scene you are looking for. So I'll just click on it. And then I'll add my text. Just tap on it and then So I'll save it and close it and when I'm done, I'll click on snapshot. Okay. So remember you can you can reduce the length of your video here. Okay. Length of your scene. You can just change here to let's say five seconds. Click on save. Okay. So when you are done with all the editing, so usually when the amount of text is too much it is recommended you reduce the size of the text so that it can be contained in the scene you can even check for matching scene maybe this one is not cool enough just click here and then check for matching scenes okay you can also change the text position maybe to your left okay the avatar will go to the right and then your text will be on the left so without wasting much of our time i'll add another scene and this will be call to action okay call to action like for them to actually sign up for that maybe you drop your phone number okay and ask them to call you now okay they have to be a call to action let me let me search maybe i'll see So, you can use this something like this and click on insert. Okay. So, there are a lot of scenes you can actually explore. Okay. So, add a text. Something like this. Save and close. Okay. So, Let's say since it's a call to action, call to action, you can change. Okay, it's seven seconds already, so I think that is okay. So whatever video you are creating, make sure it's not more than. Um, you can see it's not more than thirty seconds. Okay, so I have twenty three seconds, which is okay for a WhatsApp status. Okay. So now I'll go here now. Let's say I want to change the way it slides from one scene to another okay you can decide to choose this one or this one okay so after that i'll go to my color i think i'm okay with the color and then i'll go here now to add music okay just click on add music so the render forest has lots of music i'll just play one So I'll add music okay after doing that I think we are done with um, our design I'll just click on here to save my work so since we are using the free um, sites just click on free preview so it's going to process your video and after processing and everything it will send it to your render forest account so when it loads this is what all right so as you can all see the video has been processed all you need to do is to download but there's no option for you to download here so just click on this menu icon here 
click on your account as for me mine is isaac matt okay click on my videos or whatever you are doing if it's a logo you click on my logos but we are using a video so i'll click on my videos okay i'll just click on free preview this algo here click on it and then click on download so it is done downloading but the render forest has a watermark okay which we ought to cover we must cover it we'll be learning how to remove the watermark from the video okay let's go to your in shot and select select the video okay so what i'll be doing now is that i'll be adding a text so i'm going to give space at the beginning and then i'll give space at the ending okay so now i'll click on this color wheel click on the color wheel you can change the color of the text if you want okay let's i give it a gray color okay then we have the border the border is just like your stroke okay you can give your text a border but i won't be using it you can give it a shadow but what we are going to be using now is the label the label is like a background color for the text okay so i'll just choose a color okay i'll choose a color that rhymes with the background something like this blue now for example and then i'll click on you can change the writing okay you can change the font so after doing that i'll click on ok so now i'm going to resize it and then just bring it to this point so just rotate it until you get it perfectly So I think this is good and then I'll shape it to all the video okay and then click on okay so now you can see why I gave space at each end so I'll just play the video now you can see the transitions it uses shapes to switch from one scene to the other okay and this is a call to action so i think this is good i'll just go ahead and save my work save it at 720p which is about 19 mb and after doing that go to your video panda and compress the video thank you so much for watching i mean isaac matt bye for now